Hi everybody, we're talking from the set of our new film Belfast. And action! Belfast is a city of stories and particularly at the end of the 1960s it went through an incredible tumultuous phase in its history. No te conviene ser el que se opone de toda la calle. Si tocas a mi familia te mato. I and my family were part of that. It's a very very personal remembrance of that time when Ken was a small boy. Creo que mi padre quiere que nos vayamos de Belfast. But it's a joyful script in many respects, considering, you know, the, the very troubling aspects of what's happening. But it's also funny. You know, I think there's loads of humor in it. No sé, creo que le gusta a otro chico. Las mujeres son muy misteriosas. Y también te pueden dar un buen bofetón, abuelo. Con los años tu abuela cada vez es menos misteriosa. You know, I think family is so important as part of the Irish culture. You have your families, but you also create these extended families in your community with your neighbors. Ken and I actually grew up less than a mile away from each other. When he sent the script, that just opened up huge things in my heart about history, time, childhood. It's a spirit and a vitality and a humor, which I think is very life-affirming. Mi madre dice que si nos vamos a Inglaterra, no van a entender lo que decimos. Tú no te preocupes, hijo. Llevo casado con tu abuela 50 años y te juro que no la entiendo. ¿Tú qué quieres? Quiero estar con mi familia. Te quiero a ti. Ken's amazing at that sort of bringing out all the core goodness of people. It's a love letter to childhood. I hope that people feel the joy and sometimes the sorrows of what happens in that city. In stories like this, maybe we understand that we are not alone when, we're, when we look at these reflections of other lives. Tú sabes quién eres, ¿verdad? Sí, abuelo. Eres Buddy de Belfast, donde todos te conocen. Tu madre cuida de ti, tu padre cuida de ti, tu abuela cuida de ti, tu hermano cuida de ti y toda tu familia cuida de ti. ¡Hola, Belfast!